Gender reveals. Is it a boy? Is it a girl? Or is it Britney Spears? It's neither. It's actually a fucking alligator. Gender reveals have gotten so crazy these past years that at this point they're just so annoying. I don't want to go through a satanic ritual to find out if you're having a boy or a girl. When an alligator volunteers to do the gender reveal for the couple. You know damn well that's a lie. Did, did he talk to you? Did he like give you a written consent that he wants to volunteer to do a gender reveal for you? Ready? An alligator Come volunteers on, to do the gender what? reveal for the couple. Oh my god. Why are... Oh! It's a boy! Is it a girl? Is it a boy? Or is it a fatherless child? <laughs> Mommy, can you tell me again how daddy died? Um, well, there was this alligator... You know what? You don't want to know about it, sweetie. Who the fuck thought this was a good idea? With an alligator? Boy. <laughs> oh my- What the fuck is that? What is he doing? Oh my god. Oh my god, what? <laughs> oh my god, he's on the run! <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> they're all happily recording here, but they're like five seconds away from just dying. What if the alligator just turns, runs towards you, and just starts eating your fucking leg? Is it a boy or a girl? Oh, it's gay. What are we supposed to get from that? Is the baby a mix of colors? Like, is he gay? Is he rich? Because it's gold? What, what is his gender reveal? Oh my god. Okay, so is it a prince? Is it a prince? Or is it a princess? You guys are gonna have to find out because I'm getting so excited right now. But first, you have to play this game, and then after you play this game, there's another game that you have to play, and after you play all these games, then then we might find out if it's a prince or a princess. And finally, the gender of this baby is... Obviously, we can't tell you if you don't solve this uh, Sudoku math puzzle first. Imagine you just came back from work, you're so fucking tired, and you just want to find out, is it a boy or is it a girl? But they're over here playing 50 games. Just tell me the fucking gender. <laughs> finally? Okay, finally. It's a... It's a... It's... It's a mix. Half boy, half girl. Oh, the last one! It's a... Uh... Uh... I'm, I'm, I'm having a brain fart here, so it's one, two, three, four boy, one, two, three, four girl, and this one was a mix. I already know I suck at math, but now I know that I suck at baby gender reveal puzzles. Oh, it's a girl. Oh. Oh. So exciting. Oh my god. It only took them two hours. No one cares, honestly, though. Like, no one gives a shit. You're not announcing the next fucking queen of England. You're announcing your baby's gender for your family. This is not a fucking game show. Who can have the most creative and longest baby gender reveal on this show? It's not a show. It's just a family. Just tell us. Los Angeles, a gender reveal party sparked this massive blaze that's still burning. You know, those pyrotechnic devices that explode in blue or pink to announce the baby's sex. 
This scorched dry brush area is where the family staged the gender reveal party. The idea was to ignite a smoke canister to show the sex of the baby, but things quickly got out of hand. You see what I mean? They became so dangerous for no fucking reason. It's a gender reveal. You didn't have to start a whole forest fire to just tell us the gender. And now they have to pay more than $8 million for the damage that they caused. And you know what the funniest part about this is? Uh, we don't know the gender. They, they did a whole gender reveal, but we never found out the gender. You can't even see it on the video. They started a whole fire. You think this, this would be the craziest gender reveal out of all? We never learned the gender. Jenna Carvanitas is credited with starting the gender reveal trend more than 10 years ago. She says enough is enough. We are burning down forestry. People are dying at the parties. We cannot do these anymore. No, you think so? We can't do these anymore? So it took like a whole forest fire for you to realize that these were getting out of control? Is it? It's a boy! Uh, what? Hello? Oh my god, what's... what's what about what about the girl? There's a girl. What? The pregnant girl? The <laughs> this, this was so sad. Was the boy the pregnant one or was it her? Why did everyone hype up the boy but the girl was just left there like she was a piece of shit? She's the one having the baby. It's a boy! G g guys? Oh shit! Guys, I'm the pregnant one. It's- I'm carrying it right here. I'm the pregnant one. Hello? Babe? Babe, what are your friends doing? Wh what the fuck is going on, babe? Hello? Am I here? Are you guys seeing me? Am I invisible? Can y'all not see this fucking big ass belly? She was going in there to give her boyfriend a hug, but then the boys come in to give the boyfriend a hug. My question is, where are the girls? Did you not invite any of your friends? There's literally zero girls there. No friends, no nothing. This was just about him. But don't worry about it because at the end you can clearly see that they included her. They asked the girl to take some pictures for them. Oh my god, I completely forgot you were here. Here's my phone, take some pictures for us. I'm the pregnant one. You should be taking pictures for me. Very funny. Shut up, bitch. Taylor's gender reveal. Taylor Swift is pregnant? Holy shit, congrats Taylor! Oh, that's not Taylor. Oh, Taylor is disappointed. She's crying? Why is she crying? Because it wasn't... What the fuck? So Taylor Swift over here got mad that it wasn't a boy. Not mad, but the bitch was sad. She started crying. It's almost as she just found out that she has to pay $200,000 in student loans. As soon as they tell her that it was a prank, it's a boy, she gets so fucking happy. I would expect this from the dad because dads sometimes want boys only. Guys are jerks like that. But when you're a mom and you're disappointed that it was a girl, what if it was an actual girl and your daughter grows up, she watches that shit and she realizes that you were never happy to have a daughter? Oh, I've seen this one. Brace yourselves, this is the most annoying one so far. So the mom wants the daughter to pop the balloon but she's crying. She doesn't want to pop it, but she doesn't want the mom to pop it. So the mom gets mad at her, let's go to the balloon, and I'll never know if it's a fucking girl or a boy. Me personally, I would never let that slide because I do not like spoiled kids. If that was my daughter and she did that shit to me on my gender reveal party? <laughs> Ooh, I don't think she would see tomorrow though, yeah. Here baby, take this needle and pop this balloon for us. We're gonna find out if it's a boy or a girl. No, I don't want to do it. I don't want to do it. I don't want to pop the balloon, mom. You know what? Fuck your kid. <gasps> My balloon. That's it. You're done. Come here. The thing is, not only does this get dangerous with the explosions and the fires and whatever, these motherfuckers don't know how to pop a balloon and for some reason, instead of having a needle or something to pop the balloon, they always use a big ass knife where they're almost about to cut the person who holds the balloon. Like look at this! Why are you holding the knife like a serial killer? No! Dude look at this! The way she's holding the knife! 
You couldn't have used like a small needle, but you're over here with a knife like a psychopath. If you go a little too hard on the balloon, you're gonna stab your boyfriend. Oh no, another knife. Oh, knives never end well. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh my god, that was way too close for comfort. The way that knife is jumping and it almost looks like it's about to stab him or her or somebody in the fucking room because they're way too excited. Use a plastic knife or some shit. Okay, let's cut this cake. It's a boy, it's a boy, it's a boy, it's a boy. Oh my god. Oh, I think I, oh, I, I just stabbed myself. Someone call, someone call the ambulance. Wait, is that pink? Is that pink? Did you motherfuckers just throw? It's a girl! Oh, actually, hold on. Don't call the ambulance. I'd rather just die right here. But this is for your guys. So. No, I, I see the knife. And let's see who was correct on what they said. Please do not stab me. Why are you using a knife? <laughs> hey! It's a girl! Yay! No one was murdered! Are we done? Can we please end these? Can we please from now on just tell each other if it's a boy or a girl? I don't feel like playing Candy Crush and solving a thousand levels just so I can get to the main boss where you tell me if it's a boy or a girl. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Please become a member if you want to support this channel. It really helps me out a lot. And if you're pregnant, congratulations! You can tell us the baby's gender reveal in the comment section and it better just be the reveal. I don't want to read a full fucking book about how you got pregnant and what position you did with your husband to get pregnant. Just tell me the gender. And uh, does anyone want me to pop their balloons? Like, if you're doing a gender reveal party, invite me. I'm uh, really good with knives and popping balloons. No, I actually suck at knives and I have to be careful with this one. I'm not even kidding.